to the place at the beach um, really quick and it's such a unique environment because this is I'm in somebody's house right now I'm, I'm in somebody's house and it's so humbling when you're here in Africa and see how people live you know and it's not looking down on anybody but it certainly shows you just how people can be happy with less and it shows us what we need to do to help our people you know this is years of colonialism I was fascinated at how they could live off the land and carry things on their heads and work in the hot sun all day but I had a friend of mine say it's time for us to cut that shit out we got new technology this evolution can take place and it's an opportunity to help our people because other colonizers have not and you can see the effects of that when you come hang out with somebody and this is where they say how they live let me show you guys really quick All right, so I'm back um, with our friends, and he's showing us um, just, you know, just the digs, just a little bit more in detail. So you say you kind of sleep in here? Yeah, it's my, you know, it's not like my my house, my compound, what I rent. No, this is just like, you know, they give you to there to sleep. You know? Mm-hmm. Okay. You're welcome. You're I know y'all looking at his yeah. chest. They, I'm sure people want to know, what do you do when you exercise? Do you do sports? Yeah, I just do like, you know, just running, but not all the time I do running, just, you know, sometimes to push up mm -hmm. and just to trunk up for the kid, the, uh, the, the, the stomach, stomach the know, abs, and also the pull up. Yeah, so you do arms, yeah. abs, and cardio. And push up also. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, so you run too though, right? Yeah, I run hard, you know. I can tell you run. I can tell you do cardio. Okay, so go ahead, tell me, because, you know, I didn't want to just yeah, this, not you know, mention that. Yeah, this where I live. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. This where you bring the ladies? <laughs> this where you bring your girlfriend? Yeah, baby girlfriend, yes. Yeah, okay, yeah, ladies, yeah. he telling y'all yeah. where y'all going to be hanging out. <laughs> yeah, African <I> house. <laughs> African house. Yeah. So you take a lady back here on a date? No lady on the date. How do you how do you take a lady on a date here? Where would you take her? Like what? Where would you take her? Where would you go? No, just when I bring lady, you know, we can have a chatting, you know. You can chat, okay. Yeah, only that, you know. You gonna chat in here? Mm. You gonna bring her back here and chat? Yeah, chat, you know, sometimes. Okay, I don't see nothing wrong with it. I'm just asking questions, <laughs> you know, because the ladies want to know <laughs> what they what they gonna look forward to, what they got to look forward to when they come out here now. You know, um, now this is where y'all gonna be hanging out and stuff, honey. He gonna cook you some fish over there. Yeah. You see how? Well, you know when you cook, you know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. these are flowers. He said he got flowers for yeah, you. Flowers. So he gonna bring you a flower. And this the aloe vera, you know. Oh shoot! And you got some aloe vera. You know the ladies love the aloe vera. The white one coming out there, the aloe vera. Uh -huh. This is the one they put in the wound. That's right. When you put it there one day and then your wound will disappear. So you don't need money. We just need aloe vera. <laughs> <laughs> the ladies just want some good plants. You need aloe vera. Let I show you. Now. Okay. He said we got that. I yeah, okay. miss my joke. Y'all got it though. I'm telling y'all, look, they may not yeah, have money, but they got plants. Cook, you know? He said this is where he normally cooks, okay? Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, we saw him cooking out here the other day. Yeah, and this is cooking place, and also this is our small. This is a tree like orange. Mhm. Mm yeah, they got orange for that tree, you know. Yeah. Small ones. Mm. Yeah. You want to do some of those exercises you show? You yeah, was talking yeah, about. Do some, yeah. yeah, do a push up or two. Or four. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean this would be great. To encourage people to work out and encourage the ladies to get their tails to the Gambia. Uh-huh. 
All right. Yes. Ooh. Get it. One, two, three, four, ooh, five, ooh, six, seven, eight, nine. Ooh, ten. He keep eleven. Wow. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. That's deep. Whoa. Past ten is God level. Whoa, he's still going. Yikes. He's still going. Whoa. Okay. I'm going to stop you. I'm going to just stop you, sir. Sir, you can stop. Wow. You could have kept going. Did y'all catch that face he had at the end? Yes. Thank you. High five. I'll touch the hands for that. Wow. That was great. Thank you. Bring all your, you know, uh -huh. coaches. Yes. It cut all of that up. That's nice. I appreciate you showing us this. Okay, so why should a black woman date a Gambian man? No, it's just, it's depend on, you know, who you love, you know? When okay. you have somebody who you love, then you can, you can marry him, you know? Well, what's special about Gambian men? Yeah, you know, even me, when I get money, I can marry, you know, my, who I love, you know, but okay. not here in the village. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. But, you know, it's not easy. Everybody is thinking about something to do, mm -hmm. struggling yeah. to have good life, future, you know, then you can come to marry. Even right now, I want, I can go to marry. It's not a problem. Right. Yeah. It's not easy. So are Gambian men good to marry? Yeah, yeah. They are very good, you know. Every Gambian man is a superstar. <laughs> really? What makes them a superstar? Yeah, you know, they do hard work. Okay, like the push-ups you did over there? No, no. <laughs> but they're hard workers. Yeah, hard workers. You yeah. Know. The strongness is by the, by the, that's natural, you know. Yes. Yeah, push-up is just like exercise. Yeah. Just do, f this exercise is good for your body. Yeah. It make you more strong. So she have a strong man if she had a Gambian man. <laughs> yeah, Gambian one, yeah, definitely they are very strong. Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, thank you. I just wanted to know. So Gambian men are hardworking <laughs> and they're strong, but they have no money. No, they have no money. But they have love? Yeah, they have love, definitely. They have love. They have food? Food, yeah, sometimes they have something to eat, but sometimes they don't even have nothing to Dang. eat. Thanks. So why would I want to marry a Gambian man if I was from the States? Yeah, if you can marry him, then you can plan your life, you and him. How can I plan my life if we can't eat? <laughs> then you, he can go to work. Okay, he then, can work. Yeah, he can work. Okay. To make, you know, to, you can plan another life, you know, okay. different from another Okay. But you got love, though. But you may have food sometimes, and you may not. <laughs> this Africa, you it's must learn and live and to uh -huh. fare. That's right, and yeah. to fare. Ooh. Yeah. All right, well, thank you for telling us that. Yeah. That's real. You must live and, you know, even me, sometimes I don't have food, so I have to learn, you know. Wow. Yeah, not every time you have to eat. Okay. Sometimes oh. you don't eat, you know. Sometimes you don't eat. Yeah. You can fill up on love alone. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Okay, thank you. Now you're talking about you want a wife. You want me to find you a good sister, right? <laughs> but now you're saying you work hard. Yeah, when I have a wife, you know, I work hard with him. Uh-huh. For survival, you know. Okay. I work hard. Okay. Yeah, but some people, you know, they used to say, you know, young people, you know, they are too young. Uh-huh. So you're 22 and you was telling me that doesn't matter. Yeah, age is a number, you know, just like that. Age is just a number. Yeah, yeah. Oh. The most important, you know, as far as you can look after is it's okay. So age is just like a number, you know. As long as you can look after her? Yeah. So you were saying earlier that she may or may not eat. Huh? You said you may or may not eat some days. Yeah, you have to That look. sounds scary to a woman. You know, Africa and America is different. I know, but we want to eat out of America. So if we... If a sister wants you, she won't be able to eat. No, he will eat, but, but when what? I don't eat, but he will eat. Okay. Yeah, okay. for me, I can love okay. you know. So you'll starve yeah. and make sure she eat, though. Yeah, yeah, she will eat. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Yeah. So sacrifice. 
So y'all hard working. Yeah. Y'all are strong. Mm -hmm. And you sacrifice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then you can manage with the system in Gambia. Then you can do what? Yeah, then you with, can manage. Yeah, with survival, you know. Make it easy, easy, you know. Only that. Okay. Yeah. All right, you taking me down a way I have never been, child. This one is shortcut, you know. It's a shortcut? Yeah. I'm not used to walking through all this type of stuff, honey. It was a straight path that I usually take straight to the street, but I'm not used to all of this. Honey, we got to learn how to be led, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> oh, child, he taking me to on the old, good old country road. Yeah, it's smiley coast. This another way. Why you ain't just taking me the regular way? Video is nice, you know, but okay. sometimes our people. Oh, in the okay, okay, okay. Do something some more discreet. Yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Hey, no, cause I was like, well, keep walking. Shoot, you, is this the long way though? No, this one is shortcut. It's know? short. Okay, good. Ooh, at least the view is nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah, this mango tree, you know. Uh huh. The mango tree, nice. Yeah. The fruit of Africa. You have a lot of trees we never will see. So ladies, he may not be able to feed you every day, but if he don't have no food, y'all gonna have house. to get some. Huh? The roof house, you know. Oh, for the roof of the yeah, house? Yeah. Could you make a house out of that? No, this one is just like uh, the garden man, you know, in the garden, so we okay. can make some roof house. Okay. Yeah. Oh, girl, I'm going through the damn bush. Oh, Lord, if I fall, oh, God. Oh. Oh, Lord. Girl, he got me going under shit. Oh, no, ma'am. You thought I was from. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to show you. I'm really American right now. Yeah, you, you, got, you got me walking through nature, nature. This is concrete jungle, you know. Yeah, it's the jungle. Come on. Let's yeah. keep walking. Concrete jungle. Oh, shit. oh, girl, and it's hot. He got me going through. It's a concrete jungle, a lot of mango tree over there. Okay, it's mango trees. He's showing me mango trees still, but I'm trying to just keep going. I don't even care about that mango trees no more. Oh, Lord, I hope this is the road. Is this the road? Ooh. This is the road now. Oh, thank the Lord. Oh. Oh. Girl, that was an adventure. Oh, I got to Lord, let me watch my step. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Oh, sorry, you're supposed to be leading me. Yeah. You know how to lead a woman? <laughs> yeah. Yeah? I have to show you around. You got to show me around. Yeah. Okay. All right. Whew. Well, that concludes the end of this video because I'm out of breath. It's hot. And so is he. Yeah. Ow! <laughs> Thank you, nephew. Thank mm -hmm. you.